mass grave of alleged pro-Gaddafi soldiers has been discovered in a rebel-controlled area of the country, according to a British newspaper The Telegraph. The location was swiftly bulldozed after the discovery, suggesting an attempt to cover up the killings. The bodies were reportedly mutilated, adding to recent concerns of human rights abuses by rebels. Such crimes are being swept under the carpet to support NATO's cause in the region, or so says Sukan Chandan, a spokesman for the British Civilians for Peace in Libya movement. I think really fundamentally there's been a problem um, the way NATO, the NATO nations and their media have related to this, these so-called rebels. I mean, these rebels have been conducting mass lynchings of, of, of black people throughout the first several weeks and months of this crisis. And I raised this directly in press, press conferences and the answer was what? Silence. It wasn't covered in the media before because this does not fit the narrative since the 1999 uh, NATO aggression against Yugoslavia, which was we are conducting these wars not for geopolitical control and domination and monopolization of mineral wealth, uh, but for humanitarian reasons. So how can it fit the narrative that these rebels, which NATO and the NATO countries are supporting, are lynching black people, are conducting all the atrocities they're accusing the Gaddafi side of conducting, but actually the rebels are conducting these things. So it doesn't fit the narrative at all.